Man, just really bringing back the type of music that I love and I was just growing up and introducing it to a new generation. It's just man, it's so for me, like southern like country that just the whole lingo. And I was you know, kind of good listening to music, can't hear about that team. You know, how can you the family kind of pay a homage? And this kind of, you know, we created the same type of sound. You asked my second question because when I listen to it, it brought me back to that great skies and that getting my soul. Yeah, man, like, I, 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 I listen to that growing up, you know what I'm saying? So when you, when you, when you make music from where you're from, it's on the right, it's right. This is the person that influenced me. This is why I sound like this. So Mississippi never had its own sound. We listen to Texas music, Atlanta, Florida, you know what I'm saying? And really kind of put it together. You talk about the new world, the new music. And I, I'm just figuring out a way to put it all together, make a song. I'm in sound for my family. Yeah, man, like, I'm just trying to put it all together. Like artists like UGK, Brooklyn, how do they, you know, yeah. come into your music? Like, how does they like, do you think about the swing of the beat? You know what I'm saying? Like, we make it do what we had, man. A lot of these artists rapping about exactly where they're from. i never been to Orange Mile. But if you listen to Ava, them days, you know, they all listen to UGK, they took it. It's like Outkast, man, where they were from, Hollywood, Coke. You know what I'm saying? Eastside. I never, I, I, I never went there, but just the way he rapped about like, damn, that was G.A. Like, you know what I'm saying? And then he encouraged me to rap about where I'm from, you know, the block where he's like, this is the Queen City. I'm gonna rap about where I'm from, and put out the world and put it on, they can play. Bring me to the city, man. Exactly, man. So what was the process of that radio time for you? I mean, it started on the tour when we was out on tour with uh, with the Wiz, and then uh, on the tour Smoke Club, and then Cars, and then we was out there. And just really trying to start on tour and kind of not re recreate what went on with Crimson because it was a year, two years that I had to make that, but trying to take people in my journey from touring to make it, you know, just me that my surroundings when I was going through the label problems, the relationship problems, and take them down. Oh, man, take on the journey, man, the Lord willing to drop it, March 28th, the people bear with me, because they were patient, because it's what came out to the second, and it's free, and it's free, and it's trying to fill with that car, I was a man, it's free, and it's free, and it's free, and it's free, any other videos you got coming live from that? Oh, we'll try. Well, I'm sorry, we'll shoot videos. I don't know. Dreaming is out there now, but rotation made a lot of cheese. My soul, you know, I'm definitely rise and shine, man. Definitely the venue, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, the, the, the glove house is a bitch.